Welcome back. It's a special treat that makes you feel like you are taking a tropical trip, which I definitely would welcome right now. Simply Sweets 23 ABC's Allison Gargaro shows us an easy way to make coconut pie. Hey guys, a few weeks ago, my mom and I were going through some recipe cards that my grandmother and my great grandmother had written. And these recipes are really good, but one of them that I wanted to share with you was this amazing coconut pie. Now my mom and I, absolutely love coconut so this one is right up our alley but it's really cute you can still see the recipe card my grandma wrote in her beautiful cursive handwriting but it did get a little watermark on it but don't worry my mom knew the recipe by heart so we are going to be sharing this with you so not only is it amazing but it's also super easy to make let's get started So I said this is super easy to make and I meant it. We are going to put all of the ingredients into the stand mixer, let it mix up, and then we are good to go. So first, we are gonna start with two cups of milk. Just pour that right on in. And then we have three quarters of a cup of sugar. A fourth of a cup of melted butter. Woo, right on in there. And then what's going to bring this all together is actually a half of, of a cup of Bizquick. So you know that original pancake mix. I'm gonna pop that right on in as well. So no flour needed. And then we have one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. And then finally, four eggs. Just gonna crack these. So we have everything in the mixer except the coconut. That's actually going to be the last thing that we put into the pie before it goes into the oven, but we're gonna get this mixing up for about three to five minutes. And I'm gonna get the pan ready. So finally, everything is incorporated, so we are going to take this right on out and we're actually going to dump the mixture into a greased nine inch pie pan. So, the mixture may look a little bit unincorporated, but don't worry, that is all going to be taken care of in the baking process, so perfectly fit. So just like on my grandma's recipe card, it says to let this sit for five minutes, and then we are going to top it with this fresh shredded coconut. Now we have waited that long five minutes. Finally time to dump this coconut on top, so you just want to make sure that it is going to be falling in an even layer all across the custardy goodness. Now we're gonna pop it into a 350 degree oven for 40 to 60 minutes, depending on how fast your oven cooks until the top is nice and golden brown. Now that the pie is out of the oven and completely cooled, I just wanna tell you that your kitchen is smelling like a little island vacation. That coconut oh, is absolutely so delicious, but I did cut a little piece of the pie because we have to try this. gosh, you guys, this is so good. So it's sweet, but not too, too sweet. And then you're getting a lot of that creaminess from the eggs that we put in there. And then finally, you get to feel the texture of the coconut. And that's really what you're tasting in here. So for all of my coconut lovers out there, you are going to love this and so is your family. I have had a piece of that pie. It is so good. You can watch that full episode of Simply Sweet on our website, turn to 23.com. You can also watch a brand new episode of Simply Sweet tonight on 23 ABC News at 630 following the newscast.